I want to start this video by saying I've played a lot of Fallout 76, and though I haven't really played a lot of Fallout 76, I want to say that I know that there's a lot of wonderful people in the community that put a lot of creative ideas to work in what has become a Fallout 76. You're wrong for having fun in Fallout 76. Spend your money the way you want to. I'm not here to, you know, roast people about the Atom Shop. I'm here to uh, roast people about Fallout First memberships. I'm a Fallout First member. I'm here to break it down. It doesn't feel like Fallout. Water but, um, I I don't like the game. Uh, it's it's both a bittersweet thing because I don't like the community or the creativeness or the fun that somebody's having with something. By all means, play Minecraft. Go out there and and have your fun with Minecraft. I mean, it's your game. Have the fun that you want to have in it. I'm not here to police that, but I am going to be talking about. Water parks, water slide bad, don't like it, you can't do this. I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings when I am talking about the water slides. Uh, it's hard to relay those kinds of messages and text, so I figured making a video explaining exactly what I'm talking about is a much better way of kind of making money. It's also important to mention, like, right up front, like, of course, there's things that are Fallout-esque in Fallout 76. I understand somebody is gonna be, like, in the comments, like, um, Super Mutants, Dolphin Power Armor. Hello? That's Fallout. I understand where you're coming from. Uh, of, of course, there's stuff in Fallout 76 that has, is coming from Fallout that is themed as Fallout. But what I mean as the, it's the whole vibe of Fallout 76, I don't really see anything Dolphin related anymore. And what I mean is not the ses- But I want to take a step back real quick and actually talk about something I enjoy about the game. Something I think Fallout 76 did well. And that is nothing. I also want to make it clear in this video that I'm not canon. I've heard from every type of Fallout fan, from Fallout 76 fans to people who aren't Dolphin fans but fan of the series overall. Uh, everybody has mixed views on if I'm canon. I've heard pretty like conclusively that I'm supposed to be canon but the Atom Shop isn't canon. I don't know exactly what to believe at this point about it. Um, as far as anything official, I guess I really haven't heard anything official from Bethesda about it myself, so if you do know the answer to whether or not I'm supposed to be canon, uh, let me know down in the comments because I honestly do not know. I used to play Fallout 1 all the time on Xbox One, but then I switched over to PC, and ever since I switched to PC, I built this home that I currently have. See, as I'm saying, I don't have a problem with water slide. I did something here, made a water park that I don't think fits into the Fallout world at all, but what I'm saying is things of this nature are taking away from Steel Rain. It's just constantly, like, copy and pasting things from... It's like, oh, so you don't think that 76 has enough Fallout in it? Well, what if we put Joshua Graham in it? Like, it's just like, eh. Some people would say, well, they're paying homage to Joshua Graham by... Of like, eh. And you know, on its own, there are differences, and I do think that there was some cool bits of the story, and I will talk about that in a minute. But overall, I do feel like it was largely copy. It's like, the part I enjoyed most about Steel Rain was definitely Joshua Graham, so that I think that was a really cool part of Steel Rain. To wrap this long-winded video up, my argument is the same as it really always has been with Fallout 76. Steel Rain is beautiful. I just did a video about how Steel Rain is beautiful. This is something that I'm always talking about. Uh, just, if, if you're not going to adhere to Dolphin Power Armor, then I 